Hi, I'm Kenny Joya. Welcome to another one of my tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to match audio file volumes in Reaper. I have a project in front of me here with four audio files, and they sound very different. But I want to make either a mixtape or a mastering session and balance out or match their volumes. Let's hear them now. As you can tell, they're quite different. But we can still match their overall volume to make it sound natural. So the first thing I want to do is open up my master fader. We'll go to the view menu and choose floating mixer master, which looks like this, which is the master fader for our project. With each song on a different track, we can see their levels over here. So if we can match them, we can make them sound more consistent. Then we're going to right click in the meter, which opens up this dialog. By default, it's going to show us the peak and RMS level. We don't need the peak. We're more concerned with the constant level, which is the RMS level. Let's choose it here as well. And down over here, we could pretty much leave this alone with a display offset at 14. We could change this to any target value we want as far as luffs, but being that we're just matching the level, it doesn't really matter. We can leave it at 14. And down over here is the red threshold, which is what we're seeing right here in green. If we want it to be smaller, or just a line, we could set it to zero. We'll make it bigger. But for the most part, we could use 4 dB and try to get our levels right in the green area. So I can close this and open up the mixer so you can see the volume for each song. I'm going to start off with all of them a bit lower, about 6 dB, just to give us some headroom so we could bring up the level to make them even. Then I'm going to make the mixer smaller right here, just so we see one fader at a time. And by doing that, we could choose one track at a time, and the fade is going to jump to just the track we selected. So if I select right in here, it jumps to this fader, or this one jumps to this fader. So it'll be a lot easier to adjust the volume on each file. So let's give it a shot. Now we want to start off in the loudest section of the song, so we wouldn't play over here. We'd focus over here. Let's start with the first one and bring the level up until the average is right around here. And do the same with the second song. Then the third. And the fourth. Then we can jump back and forth very quickly, looking at the level, but also using our ears. That feels pretty good right there, both with the meter and with our ears. But we could also use a plugin to double check using a LUFS meter, which will also detect the average or constant level. So let's put a plugin on the master fader. And I downloaded one free 
from the internet, and it's called Ulean Loudness Meter. And like I said, it's free, so let's try it out. And it looks like this. And the thing we're concerned with is the level right over here. We can reset it down here, and we play it, we'll see the Luffs level, or how loud each song is, right here. We can see it's about minus 11 luffs. Let's check it on the other songs. I brought it up a bit for that one. Let's check out the third one. Reset it. And the fourth one. Reset it. That looks pretty good as far as this goes, but again, we should always double check with our ears. That sounds pretty good right there. And we can see the levels right here. Sounds pretty balanced for my mixtape, my mastering session, and I'm ready to render the final copy. So that's pretty much it. That's how to match audio file volumes in Reaper. I hope you learned something, hope you can use it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Mm -hmm.